are you vlogging? Our journey of trying to fix a car. What we have to go out and get something. That's important. Four seven four V. It looks like four four seven. I've had a stroke. We were laughing at some lady in Tesco's for wearing a bike jacket and not having a bike, and then we realised Tom is also doing the same. <laughs> My poor car has been sat like this for about a week, I reckon. Okay, so why I like, oh Tommy? Tommy boy over there is trying to get a bolt undone to fit the new brakes. I'm going to be putting these on. So what's going to happen now is I'm going to rip these poverty stricken flat plates off and put my new swanky 4D plates on, which I just can't get over. Um, so I'm just going to go for the classic see you later method. Right, so because I'm an engineer, what I've done is Put a tiny bit of uh, car shampoo on my cloth. <laughs> I'm just going to give this a quick clean. It smells good though. Not that you're going to be able to smell it. And then because I'm a genius, this side should be a wipe. Oh, God. At some point getting this recess filled would be quite nice, but for now it's not really top of my priority list because um, this and um, this um, and the missing splitter is after, um, well, after Tom ripped the splitter off and just ruined my life, really. I've done a pretty good job it's on and I honestly I cannot get over these plates I love them now this plate is actually stuck on with magnets if I remember correctly <laughs> oh is it I can't remember anymore did I glue it hmm Whatever it's stuck on with, they're very strong because I can't actually undo it. Just quickly jumping in here, it's future editing Georgie now. Um, I thought it was that plate that was stuck on with magnets, but it turns out it was this one. I knew I wasn't going mad. I had made this magical magnetised plate so that I could take it off quickly. But um, I knew one of my plates had magnets on, okay? Don't judge me. What are you on with? I think it's stuck. Oh, yeah, it's stuck. Okay. Okay, bye. So my poor postman this week has had four discs, four pads, track arms, what? Track rods. A cute little car fume, which doesn't smell how I thought it would, but it smells good. Some number plates have arrived. It's been a busy old week for my postman, but it does mean that on Tuesday, when we go to our secret event, it's not really that secret, but when we go to our event on Tuesday, the car's going to be looking mildly better than it did. So I'm really not a fan of things hanging from here. So a lot of my air fresheners tend to hang from here. But this one's really nice to look at, so... I might have to find this somewhere on display to put it. The only reason I don't like it hanging from up there is because it swings and it catches my eye when I'm driving. It's a bit distracting. So I'll have to think of somewhere else to put it. I'm thinking hanging it from here. 
because then it can still swing and waft around but it's not in really anyone's face there which is great no, it might bang the window there. Do you think? No. No, that'll be fine there. Yeah, I'm gonna hang that there. Beautiful. The first half of this video was all very exciting and I was getting lots of deliveries and then it just cut. So, it's been like, I don't know, two weeks since that first video. So, quick update on the car. We had an absolute nightmare fitting the discs and pads. It was chaos. It took three days to undo one bolt. It took many hours. It took many people. It was an absolute nightmare. We were due to go to Brands Hatch on Tuesday and the car was still being worked on at eight o'clock on the Monday night. Tuesday, we made it to Brands Hatch we were there with Ford Power Live shooting um, some pictures for their promo for the show that's happening. The car is going to a body shop to have a couple of dents removed and to repair the front bumper that was damaged by Thomas. And then after that, we've got a very long list of things that need doing to the car before April 15th, because on April 15th, the car is going somewhere to have the last thing done and that is that is our deadline at the minute april 15th 